Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we're checking out the Matador On Grid Packable Hip Pack, a lightweight, packable, hands free solution for keeping all of your everyday essentials within reach. I'm Ed from Rush Faster and we do guides and walkthroughs bringing you better gear and better ways to carry. So if any of that sounds good to you and you're new to the channel, please consider subscribing. Let's jump right in and check out the Matador On Grid Packable Hip Pack. The On Grid series is one of the newest series from Matador. It has less of a focus on the outdoors and adventure and more of a focus on urban commuting. We can see that in the clean lines and the clean silhouette and the overall aesthetic. We've actually done videos on other products in this range, the backpack, the duffel and the tote. So if you're interested in checking those out, head over to our channel and check out the Matador playlist. Just like any of the other bags in the On Grid series, the packable hip pack uses a 100 denier waterproof Robic nylon that has a UTS coating, which is an ultra tear strength coating. It also has bar tack stitching throughout the bag, as well as YKK zippers and Wujin hardware. So here is the Matador On Grid packable hip pack. It has three zippered compartments, one in the front, one in the middle, which is our main cargo compartment, and then one at the back. In terms of branding, you can see that there is a Matador text logo there, as well as the smaller logo embossed on this Hyperlon loop here. This Hyperlon loop is good for attaching a carabiner or any other accessories you want to lash on externally on the bag, so that's helpful. Just looking at the top here, there is a lightweight hole handle, not padded or anything like that, but it just provides another angle for you to grab the bag from. You can also hang the sling on a hook from this part of the bag, and you can see on the sides of the bag, there is bar tack stitching just to reinforce this part of the bag, adding extra durability. One thing that you will notice is that this bag, along with all the other bags in the On Grid series, is that there is no top stitching, the stitching that kind of follows the lines of the bag. And Matador has implemented this to reduce the clutter as well as ensure that there are clean lines to the bag, giving that overall minimalist aesthetic. Taking a look at the carry strap, the part of the bag where you'll be carrying it on your body, they're using a Wu Jin buckle, a simple click and release buckle, so very easy to use. And then there are these strap adjusters here for you to tighten or loosen the slack on the bag depending on how you want to wear it. And then at the very end we have some simple strap management here to make sure that those straps aren't dangling too much. Once again, very simple construction, very straightforward design, nothing too crazy, nothing too technical um, because you're not going to be carrying too much in this bag. Taking a look at the compartments now, once again, these are YKK zippers and they're using heat shrunk zipper pulls, so that just adds a bit more control and grip to opening and closing these zippers. This first compartment here is for smaller items, but it also serves as the compartment where you'll be inverting the bag to bring it to its packable state. So we'll take a look at that later on. The middle zipper provides access to the main cargo compartment. There's no further organization in this compartment, just a big empty space for you to chuck in all your gear. And at the back we have our last compartment. This compartment is specifically for more important, more delicate items. So things like money, any cards, any cash, things like that you wanna put in this compartment because it will be sitting closest to your body. Whether you're wearing it on your hip or wearing it as a sling bag, this side of the bag will be closest to your body. So you wanna keep all of the important stuff in here just so that it deters any pickpocketers. And once again, no further organization, just another compartment for you to separate your gear. So just to give you a sense of what you can put in this bag, I'm gonna pack it with some everyday stuff, things that you might be taking with you when you go traveling or just simple urban commuting. At the front, I'm gonna store my keys, as well as some solid state cologne. In the middle, I'm going to store an A7 memo bottle. I'm going to keep my wet wipes. I've got an Everyman Grafton pen. My Bluetooth wireless earbuds. Some hand sanitizer. Pack of tissues sunglasses, portable battery, and on the outside I'm just going to clip on my Nomad carabiner, also serves as my charging cable, and then at the back I'm going to put my wallet. 
So that just gives you a sense of what you can pack in the bag. I kind of rush packed it, so I probably could have packed it a little bit more neater, saved some space and put some more things inside. But this is a two liter bag and it's managed to fit all of that everyday gear. So pretty impressive. Now, when the bag is not in use and you want to bring it to its pack state, you open the front compartment here. And here you can see that there are two zippers here for it to be put inside out. You simply open up this compartment and invert it push everything else through that pocket doesn't have to be neat push the edges out and then you can pull on the zipper and slowly close the pack and now it's in its pack state here you can see it says matador packable hip pack two liter now when it's in this state, you can put it anywhere, you can put it in your backpack, you can put it in your travel luggage, or you can leave it in the car. Whenever you want to just empty your pockets and carry all your gear inside of this bag, that's when it becomes really handy. We've actually done a video on a similar product to this one, that is the Patagonia Ultralight Black Hole Mini Hip Pack. It has very, very similar qualities and features to this bag, maybe a bit more compartments and organization, but if you want to compare, you can check that video out as well. Okay, this is the on-grid packable hip pack on the body, around the waist, I'm 5'10". And this is carrying it crossbody as a sling. Well everyone, that is the on-grid packable hip pack from Matador. It's lightweight, it's crazy packable. It can be worn around the waist, but it can also be used as a sling bag as well. It's also great for urban commuting, but especially good for when you're going traveling. You can store this in your rolling luggage or your travel duffel, and when you're at your destination, you can unpack this, store all your essentials inside, and use this as a day bag. That's really useful as well. If you're interested in getting the hip pack, there's going to be affiliate links in the description below. If you like this video, you found it helpful and you think about getting this bag then please do use those affiliate links as they really help to support the work of this channel and even if you're not thinking about getting this bag but you still want to support us hit the like button hit the bell let us know in the comments below what you think about this bag especially in comparison to other packable hip bags and as always subscribe to see more carry gear walkthroughs if you haven't already if you want to see more videos like this or more videos from Matador then check out some of the links on the screen at the end of this video but for now this has been the Matador on-grid packable hip pack. Take care and we'll see you next time.